my sock universe. Well, I thought I'd show you a few uh, jerseys from my collection. Again, I haven't done this in a while and my collection is growing. There are many jerseys. Although of these club jerseys, there are actually not too many that I haven't shown you. I'm actually wearing another club jersey today. I'm wearing my new France 98 uh, home jersey that I got from my brother. Really nice jersey, I have to say. Just look at it. And even in the medium, I have to say, fits me quite <laughs> well. It looks actually more modern fit than it's not the baggy fit that you would expect from this, but it is a more modern fit, so right on. I decided the first jersey I'm gonna show you and then I'm gonna go back to some others. Uh, I think I've mostly Serie A and Premier League jerseys that I have still left. Uh, but since the Austrian season is about to kick off this weekend again, uh, this cup ties at first, then the season kicks off on uh, Valentine's Day. Big game, Salzburg Lask 1 versus 1 V2 already. That I show you some of my uh, at least one new Lusk jersey, and I'm gonna start with the one that actually started this season, and that's this monstrosity. Um, when I saw that this is the new Lusk jersey, I the first are you real? Is this real? Are you serious? Uh, mainly <laughs> the pink sleeves that. I still cannot believe that they were doing this. It's this sponsor, BWT, Best Water Technology, that, uh, you know, we have been selling our sleeves to sponsors. It was for three seasons, this bank, so we had yellow sleeves with this logo on it. And the home jersey gets then the uh, branding, and you can see the branding continues down the sides. This is exactly how that uh, brand is uh, sponsoring, and I can show you even on the... Europa League jerseys, I think here you see it better. There is the uh, best wall technology and you see that's exactly the color scheme. So yeah, the pink was a big ask already. Um, but then it continued that in order to make it fit with this gray, they decided that the classic black and white stripes are now grayish. Probably they would have sold a silver with a little fade towards the main sponsor logo. And this is a typically Austrian league monstrosity. You have already the big sponsors on the sleeves. You have a bank sponsor here. You The rest here, this is the supplier, because Lask is supplying their own jerseys. So this is the brand Forza ASK um, with the old crest. This is the typical crest, which now is featured on a new crest as a little inset. So they kind of took... We had um, this crest, then they had this one with a more stylist uh, flag, and then they put the old crest in there. Looks a little bit weird, I have to say, but um, maybe it's nicer overall. Um, then you have the uh, Bundesliga, which we always wear, not on the sleeves. We have it, since I can remember, it's on the shirts. And then uh, the call of arms for Upper Austria. So kind of busy already on top and then you have the huge sponsor but that's in many European leagues as well and you won't believe it more sponsors on the back first of all uh, it says on the back of the collar 1980% for you uh, because the year of founding is 1908 so that's why that number and of course, then another sponsor, which is an energy supplier. Uh, and then there would be the number and of course, two more sponsors. So um, you really want to show off all the people that give money to you. It's an atrocity. But let's go to the front again. Um, Gemeinsam sind wir Lask. So together we are Lask. And then of course the sponsor again. I actually like the color. I have to say, when I saw when I first saw this shirt, I was how can this be? But I also have to have, have to say it's this shirt that we made our first big international success uh, in a long time, beating Basel home and away. So this immediately became kind of a collector's item, especially since the shortly thereafter they changed this to black and white stripes, which 
to me looks a little bit bad and if you can watch my Europa League jersey review you see I give this a little bit a higher grade than this one but this is more special what's more my wife liked it and I wanted her to have a last jersey so this is basically I bought it for her so that she can when we go to Gold Coast Stadium that she can also have a good last jersey um, and I'm very happy to have it it's not my favorite but it's a famous jersey and for that reason I needed to have it I was hoping I can get it for a little bit cheaper than I actually did, but no, they, the drive prices didn't drop. And I said before, I'm only left with XXXXLs. Let's get uh, the one in a size that we both can wear. And so, yeah, we have this wonderful Lusk jersey at home. As I said, at first I was uh, shocked, but now I have to say, I actually find five finds like that is something cute. And nice about this one and you know the pink sleeves I could see it immediately that the uh, women supporting Lars quickly took to this jersey even my daughters like this one a lot well let me know what you think about this one as I said it's a typically Austrian uh, jersey atrocity mainly because of sponsors yes we can uh, talk about the design I think if this was with white sleeves I wouldn't actually mind the silver stripes uh, so much and even yeah I, d I don't know if you need to have the pink on there do it something differently Lask did it a little bit differently but yeah that was the next Lask jersey in the collection and we're gonna look at one more right away and let me know what you think about this jersey give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos uh, about my collection or of current happenings and I will talk to you soon bye Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates, all things that rotate in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm gonna wish you a very good day. Bye!